We would like to think that we understand what the client wants and the architect wants, be it in the vision that they see for their final project or be it in the acoustics or the fire rating that's required there. That could come down to the smallest client coming to us saying that they want a new office being built with a canteen beside it or down to somebody like Google coming to us and asking us to incorporate their new headquarters within Montevideo building which we did for them recently. We would start out by asking the client what level of privacy do they require from the office. So it may be that they want a boardroom or a meeting room where there's very much a high level of privacy required. So in that instance, we would say we would be looking at double glazed. 48 dB would be our highest rated partition system at the moment, although there are new systems that have been bought in by Optimal, which will push the boundaries of sound reduction within the industry and will take it over 50 dB. If a client is only looking to maybe separate space, we would be looking at something that's in the region of 33 dB, 12 mil tough and glass. We can move that up to a 12.8 acoustic laminate, which will give 38 dB sound reduction. Then you come into double glazed, and double glazed, as I was saying earlier, will, will lead us up to a 48 dB sound reduction. The weakest point within any system is the door. Optimal would have a range of doors which would take it from a standard timber door around about 32 dB, a single glazed door, same sort of rating of about 32 dB as well. And then we would move on to double glazed doors. The latest innovations from Optimal would bring them up to around about 40 dB, which again is a market leading sound reduction for a double glazed door within the industry. If the client wants anything higher than that, then you're getting into very much specialist doors, be it an acoustically enhanced timber door, all of Optima's solutions are tested. They are certified and they've gone through a rigorous testing. We would also like to think that if there's a slightly different solution that's required, one that is maybe bespoke, we can also provide that as well. Just because it's not in the book doesn't mean to say that we can't do it. There's no limit in terms of the size of project that we would work down from the smallest project that may be particular to a client, maybe two to 3,000 euros, 5,000 euros, up to some of our largest projects that we've worked on within the tech industry, we've worked on projects up to 3 million. So we would range really from the very smallest up to the very largest. You know, we wouldn't put any, uh, any limitation on that.